Welcome back everyone to your pod here for South 4 as Milan, where I did skip ahead a few years, ju just a few. The war against Burgundy finished, France took a fair bit of land. Uh, I did manage to complete plutocratic ideas, that just only had the manpower recovery speed plus 20%, which I can say improves a fair bit. I waited for the armies to be uh, reinforced fully, which they are, and they're now drilling. Uh, that extra merchant I got from uh, this idea, Regiment Cost and Merchants, I put in Constantinople. Now we're transferring very little cash to Ragusa, but it's something. You know, it's it's still something we're going to get for, uh, from transferring to Ragusa to Genoa. What I also did is in these main states here, um, in the Millium Romagna, I didn't do it in this one. Maybe I should. Protect trade. In these big states here, I did put down protect trade. Primarily because uh, that extra 50% trade power is amazing. So now our income is up to 18 and a half ducats about there. I did increase the uh, corruption payout. Uh, just by a little bit, not much actually. But that's, and that's pretty much all that I have done. I did take a look at the missions, and Milan needs to be at 30 dev for a renaissance city. It's currently at 26. I can definitely improve the uh, the cloth here. It's only 54 points dev up. We're only needing to dev up 4 points. So we're going to go ahead and do that. Renaissance, renaissance city, get construction cost, development cost, reduction. What does develop Lombardy do? 150 development in all the provinces in the Lombardy area. Ugh. Uh, that's interesting. Really interesting. Um, hmm. Well, at least. I, in these two states, I am prospering. So it's going to reduce my uh, my dev cost. However, I don't have a uh, encourage development. I can't switch it right now because I just uh, just did it. I just uh, got the stuff. Ooh, market town. I can save up to a thousand ducats to upgrade to level three center trade. Ah, uh, we are definitely going to get a new guy, and. Since our idea group is admin, we're going to get an admin, a bureaucrat. And the random bonus is to admin. That's fine enough. Ah, we're in Bezler, of course we are. Anyway, uh, so we need to upgrade the dev in these areas. But, you know, I've got a fair bit to... Silking Como. So do I have a chance of getting... I want to know what that is. I don't know what it is. All roads lead to Milan. Capital is Milan, no? Development at least 40. No province in Western Europe has higher dev. Oh, so we need to be a higher dev than the highest dev province, which is Shayland right now. Interesting. I'm, this is new to me, the entire Milani's mission tree. I'm just, you know, exploring this side since we haven't really looked at it much. Fortify passes. Well, I do need... I can probably start working on that. I do need Friuli and Trent. What's the status on Trent? I probably need to get a claim on them. I can get the diplomat out of Spoleto. And, of course, it'll bring Venice in, but I'm not worried about Venice at this point. So I guess I can just go ahead and build a couple castles on them. On, uh, I need to get, uh, I get a castle on, there we go. That province. Um, I can get rid of it, to save money I can get rid of the castle on Mentova. Because it's right in between two other cast, uh, two other forts. Don't really need it. The other castles I'll need. Do you know what I'll need? It's a uh, hills bonus. 
Mont my capital, so a nice level 3 fort for extra protection. Como is in the mountains, and I do need it for that mission. So everything is good. Breshka is in the hills. Even uh, Ferrara is in the farmlands, but the thing is the reason why I'm keeping it, It's th even though it doesn't give me any extra bonus in battles, is that it prevents, uh, pro prevents the AI or any enemies uh, going into this area down here, or even to Genoa. Another thing I did want to do is expand the navy, because our navy has been absolutely shit this entire game. And it's okay to go over the naval limit, at least I believe, because it, going over the naval force limit is not that damning. So I'm just going to get a whole bunch of galleys. Um, what do we have here? So the nobility want me to vassalize Trent. I don't think so. Milano, at least 11 base packs. Or Pavia, at least 8 base production. You know what, we'll go with Pavia, it's cheaper. For now. So, 8 base production, I can do that. And I get free money. Which, you know, who doesn't like free, free cash? Um, go ahead and get me Regimental Camp and a Coastal Fortress. Base Manpower and Luca. Nice. Thank you very much. So this is probably going to be more of an uneventful uh, episode because, you know, I'm kind of blocked here. Uh, Florence is allied to France. I don't want to bring in France, which is my ally. Uh, so North Austria protects... Oh, they won't protect Switzerland. I could grow tr uh, the three weeks. Although I do want Trent to, Trent and Friuli to complete my missions. Yeah. Okay, so there's no way I'm going to be able to face Venice on the naval front. Matter of fact, actually, let's go go ahead and get prepared for a war against Venice. Um, and a religious turmoil in Burgund Bur Burgundy, Brandenburg, I don't really care. Uh, guiding principle of administration. Do I want administrative possible policies plus one? Or diplomatic possible policy plus one? I think I'm going to go with the administrative. So we're going to go with political principle. So that means I can have one more policy in the admin. The admin sector. Which is pretty awesome. And overall, exploring the Ambrosian Republic after the Emperor update, I quite like it. It's a nice, uh, unique mission. Anyway, uh, idea next on admin. Sure, we'll go ahead and work on economic. Continue or to continue work on economic. Get that work on to the statue of monopolies and actually both the statue of monopolies and the other plutocratic idea or uh, policy here are both really good, in my opinion. All right, so we've got the claim on Trent. Ah, uh, Austria would join. Because Trent is a part of the Empire. Shoot. Our war on Venice. If we bring in a Pope. I don't mind that. We can call him Austria. But I think... Switzerland would be a better option. Actually, go up here. Up to Chur. Because Austria wouldn't join. Because Austria hates them. Alright. Go ahead. In. We can get English dot. Matter of fact. Wait one day and I can get access through Austria. There we go. Uh, detach a siege and go for their capital. This should be an easy short war. And I realize... The audio is probably way too loud. There we go. <laughs> More idiots. Uh, okay. I probably need to get rid of this now. Uh, Church and Kuno, for sure. Should probably also bring it down to 
three speed because I didn't realize the English dot had an army there. Should probably retreat from that. All right, so you want to in. I can do this now. What would first first one is Cunia right here. Church. There we go. And since I'm building three forts here, I don't need a fourth one in Cunio. So go ahead and get rid of that. I didn't realize I had a fourth one there. And there's the uh, Nuremberg army. I'm just going to go ahead and artillery barrage this. It's just to make it go faster. And so this, also this one guy, one stack guy doesn't uh, die. I'm going to put him with the main army. I'm taking a lot of attrition actually. A lot of attrition I probably don't need. And here comes Spoleto. Matter of fact, I uh, he's attached to uh, this army here. I lost the leader there. That's probably why I lost the battle. That's a pretty good uh, field general, honestly. 333. Three, three. Zero, though. Hmm. Get behind the fort. Yeah, I'm not helping you there, mate. What's the numbers like? We do have more. Just... I'm working on getting their capital. Although I should... No, I can't go around. Uh, Burgundy probably won't... Yeah, they were not going to allow me access. Hmm. Yeah, I'll go... I'm going to go ahead and uh, go on top of... Uh, Wolfstädte. Or Städte. And it seems like they're just going to let me siege Bern, even though it's a hills fort and they'd get the bonus. The AI is just going to let me siege it, which is nice. Should also probably just give this two, three leagues. No, nope, no, nope, they're going to go siege my vassal down, which is fine. Yeah, I'm, t I'm, t I'm losing a lot of men. Should probably get at least the cavalry off of there. Never mind. We got that siege, and we got mission fulfilled. Fortify the passes. Oh, really? I don't need... Oh! On one of the following provinces. I see. Forts owned by Milan that are located in, in any of these specific provinces will be upgraded. Get local fort... Hmm... Not bad. So what is the Alpine Wall? Uh, no northern Italian provinces is owned by a country that is not a Latin culture group. It is owned by a, a subject of a county that is... I have to grab Istria out of Austria because it's a Dalmatian culture. Which is an Italian and the Italian culture group. Interesting. Okay. I'm going to make a two pronged attack. Attack the Swiss here, although that is, they're in the hills. I'm going to. That means I'm going to take a pretty bad penalty. Hmm. Although, going here to... Oh, now they're going to retreat. That's probably the best idea for them. I wanted to get that advantage in the mountains, but unfortunately, I couldn't. Uh, Vorlberg is in the mountains as well. Where are you guys going? Constance is farmlands. I can take that. Go ahead and grab... That battle. And reinforce it very much so. Alright, there we go. We won that battle. The larger stack, go deal with... Uh, go deal with Nuremberg. Because if we do this... Ah, shoot. They're going to get off of that. Which is good. I mean, it's good considering we need to uh, wait for our morale to tick back up. 
Yeah, if I lose the we admin power. All right, looks like most of our uh, morale's ticked back up, and I'm not gonna be able to catch them in Baron. Shoot. Well, I'm just gonna do a little bit of carpet staging, I guess. That's yeah, woods and a river crossing for us, unfortunately. Although they might try to go for my 11 stack. Nope. The AI just cannot make up its mind. Sit in Constance. Alright, we completed that. Patrician Kuno. Cuneo, actually. Ah, oh, shoot. Lost another leader. Now that's a good leader. I like that. I like that a lot. Come on, try to catch this guy. No! Ah, he has two. He's got a little bit of maneuver. I mean, I probably can take him. I don't know what I'm thinking. Famous last words. I mean, the Swiss are coming in. Shoot. Although, if Swiss come in, they take a river crossing penalty. Or we just stack wipe the Nurnbergians and the Swiss come in too late. That's also a good option. All right, I think we can just go ahead and... Oh, the Swiss retreated to Brichgau. Interesting. Well, does Nuremberg want to peace out? Just do a normal white peace. No, I'd have to go and take their lands. Fair enough. English dot has won. All right, I think I can fall back a little bit. Divvy up some land a little bit. And there goes the Swiss army. Awesome. I could also probably build a manufacturing. Yep. Very cheaply, actually. And English stop. You want out? Of course you do. I don't care about religion, so I'm not going to... Ooh. Ooh, the center of fashion. Milan. I like that. I like that a lot. All right. Just how much would it be if I took all of that? A lot. That's right, Zurich is high dev. Yeah, they're pretty high. Actually, this entire area is just 17 dev. That's a lot, actually. Wow. I wasn't expecting it to be that much. Okay, so they take that. How about War Rip? And just some hard cash? Actually, would you just give me everything? You're just gonna give me everything. Okay. I am completely fine with that. Alright, you guys run down to Genoa, you run down to Milan. And with the money I got, I can build another manufactory in Novara. Manufactories are so good. Okay. So with that, I've got a fair amount- oh, to be fair, it is also not only 17 dev land, it's 17 dev land in the HRE. There's going to be a lot more AE. Okay. So before, actually, I want to say before I recorded, I started construction of of some light ships. So I can go ahead and protect trade in Venice and in, where is it, Genoa. Also, I want both of you to go home at war. Because you both will be annihilated if you uh, if you were ever caught by, say, the Venetians. Okay, you guys don't have to connect to my army anymore. You're, you're completely fine. And I think it's about time to start building up our 10 stack. Let's just drill again. Yeah, that seems like a good fine idea. And honestly, three leagues once a march, we'll give it to them. I don't plan on annexing them anytime soon. So giving them a march is probably a good idea. Let's see, what else can I do with them? 
I can build them their forts. I can subsidize their armies, etc., uh, etc. Et what I do need to do is uh, grow a stiletto here. Tech. Yep. Grab the musket. And of course, our thing here is growing. Our uh, corruption is growing because we're very much behind on our diplo tech, for obvious for obvious reasons. Um, we did grab the trade, well, trade power. That's good. And we're actually almost done with economics. And that's even better. All right. Everything's looking just fine. I honestly don't know what else. To, what the hell is going on with Iberia? That is just. Oh my god. That is disgusting. Absolutely disgusting. But, I mean, I'm so sorry to end it on here on just a crime of border gore. Uh, I'm a little over. So, please like and subscribe if you want more. Head over to the Twitch channel if you want more content via streaming. And head over to the Discord if you want to hang out there. With that, goodbye.